bottom line was that uh, the young generation of 20 plus uh, college students, or 20 plus years old student, uh, college students, care a great deal about their privacy. And they're very thoughtful about this, and they think about the long-term repercussions of the actions, and um, they really um, kind of eager to, uh, to make things work so that they could continue enjoying uh, the very personalized and very accessible and free products online, and at the same time, uh, being able to worry less about the long-term repercussions of the online actions uh, when it comes to uh, employment, personal relationships, uh, and so forth. So, um, there are two uh, kind of takeaway points. First is that they want more control over their uh, privacy. And more control here doesn't mean necessarily being able to fine tune the different aspects of how they share information online, but uh, they want the default, especially on social networks, to be private and not public. They want uh, to have a better understanding of what public versus private in this context means, what information is being collected about them and how this information is going to be used and they want um, simple ways to configure their privacy. They want basically a switch private versus public or an easy option to opt out of disclosing information uh, to the services that they are using. 